And what's happening guys, Ginger Sanji here, coming to you live from my freaking living room. And today, we're playing more Pokemon Randomized Elite for Green of the Let's Play. Now, last time we left off, I believe we, uh, yeah, just got done fighting through this whole route. Um, Jeremy being at level 39, we're gonna swap hoots up front. Uh, did we finish all the trainers on this route? I cannot remember. Was this old man a trainer? Oh, okay, he was. Well, interesting way to start off the episode. Anyways, guys, so, uh, yeah, how's it going? Um, you know, we're doing some Pokemon randomizing. And he has a Poopatar. Oh, shiz. This was not a good matchup. Well, for now, oh, did I really just... Uh, actually, uh, wait, is he... I don't think he's Dark-type yet. Uh, okay, he's not Dark-type yet. I was about to... I was about to cry if he was. <sighs> Alright, uh, I think this episode, guys, to make conversation, I'm just gonna, I think I'm more so gonna just talk about, like, oh, yeah, I'm gonna start doing question of the days for my Pokemon videos, so this one is gonna, this Pokemon, well, question of the day for all my videos, so this question of the day will be, what is your favorite, uh, I guess, s let's go starter Pokemon, like, this isn't one of my favorite like, Meganium is not one of my favorite starters. In fact, it is my least favorite starter, to be completely honest. And I only chose this because it was the best option. Anyways, guys, my favorite starter of all time, I'd have to say, is a tie between Squirtle and Trico. They're just really cool, and I'll actually explain why. Because I love... Oh, he has a cargo. Okay. Um... The fact is, like, I love Trico and how fast he is, and his special attack is pretty good. It's like, he's just great. And then there's the matter of, like, Blastoise, his special defense is pretty good. He's also kind of bulky at the same time, though. Somewhat. He's not super bulky, but... I've seen him bulk up some things, and he's... He's... He's okay. He's okay. He gets it done. He gets it done. Me, personally, if I were to run a regular Blastoise, I'd probably run, like... Scald, Ice Beam, um, ah, shiz, I haven't ran a Blastoise in forever, guys, it's been so long since I ran one, I don't even know what to run on him anymore, it's so weird, hmm, okay, but for Sceptile, this is what I usually run now, I usually run Dragapulse, um, I'd, yeah, Dragapulse, Focus Blast, uh, Giga Drain, and, um, I want to say Hone Claws. Like, I know a bunch of you are going to argue with me, like, oh, why run Hone Claws? I, I'd only run it because the accuracy of, uh, Focus Black sucks. So it's like, in case ever there's, like, someone I'm battling and they go for a switch and I predict that switch, I can get a Hone Claws up. And then, boom, I have an accuracy boost, and Focus Blast is sure to probably have, like, a 90% chance, if not a 100% chance of hitting. So, all in all, to me, it's it's a good strategy, but that's that's just how I run it. You guys could run it differently. Yeah, but that's why Sceptile is one of my favorite. And, to be honest, I only run... I only like the first evolutions of the starters. Other, well, not all of them, but like out of like out of this game, though, out of like uh, Squirtle, Charmander, and Bulbasaur, definitely gotta go with that Squirtle. Like, definitely, guys. If this was regular, I would have chosen Squirtle, like I always do. Um, I could have chosen like I feel like I could have chosen like Bulbasaur because. If you guys have ever played a soul run in this game with just Bulbasaur, I have done that before. It is the easiest thing ever. Bulbasaur is really fucking good. Don't get me wrong. I don't hate him, but I think he's a decent he's a decent trainer. Or not trainer. Damn it guys, I fucked up. He's a he's a decent starter Pokemon, to be completely honest. He's got some good, you know, special defense and special attack. He's basically like Sceptile, but not as fast. In if that makes sense, it does. It should make sense. Um. Anyways, guys, sorry about my ranting about like why I like about how I'm complimenting some of the starters. It's just this is a way for me to make conversation. 
And yeah, so I'm gonna continue. Uh, I guess like all right, I'll move on to Charizard. Charizard, in my opinion, yes, is definitely a really good starter. Definitely a really good one. And um, one thing I didn't like though is that they gave him two Megas. I didn't like that. They could just kept his Mega X and then just called that his regular Mega because, like, sure, Mega Charizard Y is pretty OP. I'm not gonna, that's not something I'd lie about. Mega Charizard X is really powerful. He's too powerful, if anything. He just, he's just too strong. Mega Charizard Y is really powerful, and so is Mega Charizard X. Uh, but me, personally, I, I try and, to be honest, I like both the same. I don't personally pick one over the other, because one's just specially offensive, and the other one's physically offensive. Oh, that one, that, that dark tree lived. I just heard some screaming outside. I feel like someone's getting murdered. Well, you know what? That's something else I'm gonna move on to. I'm gonna move on to murder, actually. No, I'm joking, guys. I'll move. I'll move that on to another. Ooh, a bulb story. Anyway, so back on to Charizard. If I were to run a Charizard X, uh, I'd probably run Thunder Punch, Fire Punch, D Dance, maybe Earthquake, maybe no Dragon Claw, Dragon Claw, Dragon Claw. I don't know why. It's I don't know why I said Earthquake, so yeah. Dragon Claw. And then for Charizard Y, I run Solar Beam, uh, Dragon Pulse, Air Slash, and either Roost or f oh, or Heat Wave. I don't know why I didn't mention Heat Wave in the start. Anyways, so yeah. Those, are my, those would be my movesets. They're not super fantastic or anything, but they're, they're okay. Uh, let me go on to Gen 2, I guess. Oh, that's right. Oh, my Pokes pet is poisoned. That's not what I wanted to do. We have three badges, by the way. Damn it. I'm trying to look at my bag. Okay, um... Uh, do, 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 do I not have a poison heal? Do I not even have a full heal? Oh, this is bad. This is bad. Okay. Well, this is not good at all. Well, moving on. Moving on out to a castle. Moving on out to a castle. Moving on out to a castle. Uh, okay. Son of a gun. Good thing this isn't a Nuzlocke. Otherwise, I'd be screwed right now. Boots, are you gonna die? No, oh, he's he's got over half. He's still he's still good for a bit. Eh. Good thing the Poke Center is at the start of the town. Go, go, my trainer. Go, you're you're my trainer's really slow, guys. He's fat. He needs he needs some exercise. Right, anyways, uh, moving on to Gen Two starters, I guess. Um, I I guess I'll start off with uh, Typhlosion. Uh, this one's a more common moveset. Uh, I think I'd rather run Flamethrower or Eruption on him. And then I'd also run, um, probably, uh, da -da -da -da. ah, jeez. I haven't looked at Typhlosion's move pool lately. That's tough, that's tough. Definitely tough for me. Since I haven't looked at his move pool lately. Uh, Focus Blast, I guess. Um... Yeah, either one of those two. And then, um, I guess, okay, I'll just move on to for Alligator. For Alligator, I'd run D-Dance, Waterfall, Ice Punch, and Earthquake. That's a pretty powerful move set right there. Uh, one sec, guys. I gotta go BRB. I gotta use the bathroom. So see you when I get back. Fudge, I didn't... Best pause, okay. Oh, uh, one sec, let me just. Okay, eh. Uh, okay, let me just pause right here, guys. BRB, gonna go use the bathroom. You guys, welcome back. Um, sorry about that, I had to use the bathroom real quick. I'm back, though. Uh, ready to go. So, anyways, yeah. Uh, moving on. I guess there's not much about for Alligator, I can say. It's a really basic moveset that everyone runs. 
I feel like I'm just going to go grab that Eevee, and I think I'm just going to end the episode there, guys. Uh, it, actually, it won't be Eevee. That's right. It won't be Eevee. I randomized this. That's right. So it won't be an Eevee. It'll say Eevee, but it's not going to be an Eevee. Uh, da -da 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 -da. I remember I found this out just by playing Fire Red one time. I found I found out you could get an Eevee. I was like, whoa, that's cool. I was like, man, that's so cool. Anyways, moving on to Meganium. Uh, me, personally, I'd run a bulky setup, more of a wall, because that's kind of what he's meant for. Uh, so I'd run... I obtained an Eevee. Is it still Eevee? Yes, I want to give it... Oh, wow, it's still Eevee. Uh, okay, guys. Um, ah, shiz. Ah, oh, man. Oh, man, this is hard. What to name Eevee? I'm debating here, because I'm not sure. I think I'm going to turn him into a... Flareon, I think. I think that's what I want him to be, but I don't have any stones. Um, what to turn him into? You know what? I'll just go with, um... I'll just go with... We'll, we'll call this Eevee... We'll call him Frank. Kinda looks like a Frank. Let's just go with Frank. Let's go with Frank. No, not Frank. Let's go with Frank. Now we have Frank, our EV. Welcome to the club, guy. Welcome him to the club, guys. Oh wow, got to do some major grinding on him. Quiet nature. Oh jeez, that means I have to go with the. That means got to run away too. So I might as well just go with a Vaporeon or a Jolteon. Uh, whichever one, I guess. I'm not sure which one to go for exactly. Anyways. Uh, anyways, back to the Meganium setup, and then I'll end the episode. Um, let's see, so Meganium setup, I'd probably set up Toxic, Synthesis, uh, Light Screen, no, Reflect, max out, it's like Special Defense and HP. Uh, so yeah, Reflect, and then maybe an Offensive move. Something like, I don't know. Some Offensive, like, some specially offensive move on him. That's what I would run on Meganium, personally. Because, you know, every wall's got to have some sort of an attacking move. Like, even Fortress gets, like, Gyro Ball. And, like, same with Frothorn, it gets Gyro Ball as well. It's pretty, it's pretty decent, to be honest. So, yeah, guys, um, I guess we'll end that here. Uh, if you guys enjoyed the video, please hit the like button. If you didn't enjoy this, even hit the dislike button so I know I have to make this journey uh, somewhat better. Yeah, somewhat better. Don't know how. Yeah, but somewhat better. Uh, also, if you want to see more of my videos and help me to 50 subscribers, uh, please hit that subscribe button as well. I'll see you all next time. Goodbye.